It's fanfic time! <laughs> Get ready. What I want is, <laughs> I don't want to read too much, so I'm going to read the first word and the last word of the fanfic. Really, don't be a douche. Wow. Seriously, Lily. I'm not being a douche, I am, I mean, you, you're a douche. Suck my <laughs> dick. <laughs> you're a dick. A dick. Your dick sounds like it's in water with all of you. <laughs> <laughs> I got pure felt when you said that. Damn it! <laughs> Wait. Oh no! Don't freeze on me. Ah. Uh, ah! Uh, I can't move. Okay, I, I can move now. See, your Skype freezes too. It's no, bullshit. No, it was my Skype. It was. Um... Hey, you know what? Uh, there was this one time when I was text chatting <laughs> with someone, and then my and then the clock in Skype seems to be going fast forward. I mean, when I send message to a, messages to a friend, it'll be like a month or two ahead of where I of when The longer I we wait, the more I don't want to do this anymore. I'm trying. Well, Lou, you're not on computer, right? You're not on computer, right? And I can go to my computer. <clears throat> We're not. Because <clears throat> I can because I was I was gonna type out the whole entire. I'm not, not type it out. Copy and paste. The... Type it out. Go ahead. Type it. <laughs> type it out. Go... We got all day. I was gonna just send, it to, just send it as a text file. Send it to everyone as a text file. I can then... send. It, I can send it to Spyro, but I can't send it to Louis. Louis on his tablet, so it doesn't work that way. He's on a mobile device. So I was on copy and paste. <clears throat> the... I was able to download files from from someone through my tablet. Uh, God, my... really? Did you not hear me before? Seriously. You can go to your computer. Okay, go to your computer, Louis, so I can give you this freaking file, so you can read on your. I'm, 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 I'm Sweet here. Can receive files on a smartphone. Okay, I'm gonna just put it right in there. Go oh, ahead. I... Okay, just... So I. Oh, your... I have to download it. Gross. It's a freaking. Nothing. It's 24 kilobytes. It's gonna That's destroy so my fucking much. It's gonna oh, destroy my oh. hard drive. <laughs> See, Kai the shit I downloaded pain. from Kai a few days ago is about a gig and a half. Everyone cheered in celebration as... I have, a, I have a freaking terabyte computer. I don't care about space. I, only, I used to do stuff on a Kai, 20 gig hard drive. Kai, finally kissing their oh, wedding. No... I used to do stuff I on already, 20 I already started. You didn't start nothing, Louie. I already started. He started masturbating to it. Uh, I've started recording now, Kai, and also you have to do some kind oh, of thing. Oh, fuck, this is the one to where oh, we have to scroll side to oh, side. Oh, I've been recorded. I, I, I've been recorded. It's been six minutes now. <laughs> Keep uh, it all in. I think it's, uh, I don't know. Make it uh, pro kind of professional. I mean, make uh, some kind of intro and it's with special guests, the writer of this fanfic or something along those lines. Uh, like the cat puss. Keep, I, it, cat I, keep puss. it professional. I, I Have you seen us? That's a good question. <laughs> That's a good answer. <laughs> we will talk about, I swear, halfway through this fanfic. We will stop to talk about an otter having sex with a six-fingered gopher. <laughs> we will talk about something like that. That always happens. I have never seen us ever act professional. The only time I've ever, ever act professional is when I'm, well, when I'm reading really, by myself. Well, yeah, not, like, you're just like, Twilight's book fort. Twilight was playing kind of, book fort uh, with Princess Cadence and all yeah. professionals. Yeah. No jokes. But then with one other person, it's clop yeah. everywhere talking about it. I, I mean, the recording should have some kind of intro or something, and then Kai would say something like with special guest lame guy or something. With special guest, lame guy. <laughs> there you go. There, 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 there's the celebratory fat. Kai, 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 there you go. I found, I found your beginning picture. Ow. Uh -huh. What is it? God damn it, Louie. I, I like it. Derpy, but I think of her as Kai, so I don't like do anything. <laughs> I think of um, her. She's like Kai's. I think I have of Barb. Derpy as Derpy as her own original character. Not her original character. 
I have Barb in the I'll, Kitty Mark Crusaders. Uh, my name is Blonic. I'm my own original character. I don't really do pony LCs. <laughs> so, uh, shall not, we get the. Uh, yeah, we yeah, we should get started. We we have been going on for uh, do, uh, nine minutes. We should do an introduction. We're going to keep all that in. Uh, stalled too much. Okay, we got Spinnerl, and we got Luis, and we got Lame Guy. My name's Luis. <laughs> oh well. <laughs> yeah. Um. Bye. Can we please start. All right, Louis. We start. Impatient. We start. Well, I was gonna. Fine, uh, Louis, then start. you start. start read the first paragraph. Start. Yeah, Louis, yeah, read it. Read the first paragraph, Louis. I think we'll just try again because we've been stalling way too much again. Yeah, yeah. yeah go ahead, Louis. Go ahead. You, you go first. Oh well. Everyone. That's Keep all going, Louis. God damn it, Louis. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not starting the fanfic, uh, someone else do it. We'll get, deal, we'll get bored. Let's uh, have the special guest, the author, read the first paragraph. Okay. Oh yeah, me. Yeah. Uh, well, I, I'll just explain some details about this fanfic. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> 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 20 years <laughs> later! <laughs> and now on to my second point! <laughs> oh well. Everyone cheered in celebration as Sierra and Knight finally kissed in their wedding, completing their oh. long marriage with their Fong friends who have since anticipated, uh, anticipated for such an event to occur. The happy Fongos clap, clapped their hooves during this once-in-a-lifetime event as they finished their provo proposal. Alright. I have to scroll back and forth and I this is pissing me off. <laughs> Once the wedding has finished, a couple have headed to the castle while discussing about plans on what to do in the near future. As they walk towards their destination, Ami, who's been following them dressed as a beautiful bridesmaid, overheard a cry somewhere in the woods which the couple didn't notice as they were too busy talking to each other. Well, am I gonna try to do some uh, voice acting or anything? I'm not sure how well this will turn out. Okay. You can do it. Um, can I stay here for a little while? Need to check on something nearby, but I'll head directly back to the castle. <laughs> 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 I, I can't stop myself from laughing. I tried to hold it. Oh that was awful. I tried to hold it. Bite. I tried to hold it. I broke laugh. skin on my finger trying not to bite. <laughs> never again. I'm never going to do a voice act again. Okay, who's next? We've crushed his dreams. <laughs> never mind. <laughs> 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 okay. Next. What, what line are we on? Uh, sure thing, Ami. Okay, go ahead, Spyro. Sure thing, Ami. Oh, okay, go, go ahead, totally Louie. Yeah, totally Louie. Totally. Okay, okay, go ahead, Spyro. <laughs> sure thing, Ami. <laughs> <laughs> sure thing, Ami. Sierra, answer. Just don't stay here for too long. As the sun is about to set, you don't want to get lost in the dark. What the fuck are you two laughing at? <laughs> All right, I'll go. <clears throat> I don't know how to pronounce I can't these stop names. <clears throat> it's Ami, Sierra, and Knight. Okay. Actually, sure, uh, not sure, sure thing, Ami. Sierra answered, "Just don't stay there for too long, as the sun is about to set. You don't want to get lost in the dark in a place like this, right?" She added. Emmy nodded her head and agreed, and then Shifley heads in agreement. off. <clears throat> oh, oh, in agreement, and then Sh Shifley heads off to where Swift. the crop. Swiftly. I said that. <laughs> you said Shifley. Oh, you, you said Shifley. Go ahead. You're stalling again. Uh, you know, I'm gonna say Shifley because just to screw, <laughs> screw you guys. Okay, Shifley. Just. <laughs> I know it's Swiftly. Okay, fine. Swiftly heads off to where the crying sounds was coming from. It took her a while to finally get to the source of the cry while being careful not to damage her beautiful dress. As it was rented <laughs> and is quite expensive. There she finds a familiar 
looking cat with tentacles tails. <laughs> sitting <laughs> sitting on a tree stump crying. Hashtag I've seen enough hentai. <laughs> it's like, 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 like it was a catapult. It was a catapult. <laughs> it's like it's a strange, oh, adorable oh, looking cat. A, wait, uh, what's that? Um, as a heads up, Ami here is actually portrayed as a twelve-year-old girl. Awesome. Oh, now we're okay. So we're reading Lolly. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, oh, yeah, that's what I wanted. I that's like what that. I want on my well, Miss Butler Art deserves this anyway. For screwing me over and another deviant, yes, yeah, and several others. What is Sparrow's? What is Sparrow's favorite fanfic right already? <laughs> it it was... was a catapus, a strange and adorable-looking cat and octopus hybrid, who tend to follow Sira uh, around as Amy's favorite pet. Looks like spelled favorite wrong. Oh, Louis, the Spelled one with drama. Every, yeah. You couldn't even yeah, spell the word it properly. Hey, it's correct. I couldn't spell. say the word it. You, you said, uh, no, I couldn't say the word it, but I can spell it. Spell yeah, it? sitting there. What's that word? What's that two letter <laughs> word that you learn in kindergarten? Stand aside. He's Spyro. very perverted. Is it Stegosaurus? He's a creature whose former primary life goal is to fuck Sia, but in, but in his. Very polite about it. He usually ends oh. up getting kicked away by Sira whenever he asks about it. <clears throat> However, he also is polite enough to not go full on rape and never tell tells a a Amy about <laughs> this. <then. laughs> what? <laughs> well, I guess we're we're wait. <laughs> Viewers, don't judge me about. Uh, don't judge In this me. sense, she's too young to know this sort of thing. Oh, what the hell happened? Wait, wait, oh, wait it, where are you? It scrolled, it, it scrolled down by accident. Hold up. Oh, we are having so it's much link problems. To an old gif I made of the catapus. Here we go. And she's too young to know about this sort of thing. It was quite unusual for Amy to find him crying all alone and out in... All alone out in the woods and seeing him in such despair makes her feel sorry about him and is willing to help him out. Fuck. My turn? My turn? Si, sí, senor. Okay. What's wrong, Catapus? Did, you, did someone hurt you? I mean, ask the Catapus kindly. It's it's just that Sierra had just married now, which means I could no longer interfere with her anymore. I've been waiting for a very long time to do something to her, but I can no longer do it without harming her too much. It's too late now. The cat was struggles to answer Ami's question as he's been crying heavily. Oh, I'm sorry, my dear Catabus, but that's how things are supposed to go. So, what can I do to help? And what is this thing you wanted to do with Sierra exactly? It might be the reason why she hates you so much, Ami said in a calm, loving voice. <coughs> well, I'm afraid that saying it will only make you angry. Also, you're too young and innocent to know it, Catapus answered, still sobbing while wiping his tears with one of his tendrils. No, I won't get mad at you for saying it. Just tell me what it is and I will try to my best to fulfill it, just to make you happy, my dear. I don't care if I'm too young as I will try my best to fulfill it for you, Ami replied love replies lovingly. Okay. Next. Wait, really? Wait a minute. Wait a minute. <laughs> what? Tendril. Tendril. It's a <laughs> drill. <laughs> yeah. Guy, it's a drill. No, 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 no. Uh, I, thought that, I thought that's another term for tentacles. Yeah, tendril. Yeah. Guy, it's a drill. <laughs> Yeah, There's yeah. no drilling here. Yeah, and the yeah. Yes, Louis, we yeah, all Louis. get it. Ha ha ha, the joke of that let's play. Ha ha ha, Louis. That, You're that, such a it, joker. It, ha, ha, I, ha, I, I know, you, you, you probably Louis find it very annoying, but it's West. still funny, no matter what. It's not funny, Louis. Hey, that Louis, joke this died is... three yeah, months ago. You see, that's a, you yep. see, you see, you heard that sound? That's the sound of your career dying, Louis. You're not a... <laughs> uh, what career? Oh. That's the point, Louis. What career? You, you okay, can't kill somebody that was never alive. Okay. Really? Now you better be careful. Louis will totally own you on World of Warcraft. <laughs> he plays that shit like every day. 
<laughs> he has nothing else to do. Hey, hey, hey. Too much. They're probably bored of viewers by now. Oh, no, oh, they love no. this. <laughs> oh, uh, oh, they'll sit continue. through anything. Hey, that, that's not true. Anyway, they especially <laughs> love when Louie's around. Hashtag shoot Louie. Yeah, I know. Hashtag <laughs> fuck Kai. <laughs> Stop it! Don't. It's, gonna, it's, gonna, it's gonna appear on Twitter again. I don't want that to appear on Twitter again. You're the one who started the hashtag thing. That's the point. I don't want it to continue. Anyways. So wait. So don't start it. Did not make it? All right. I didn't make Twitter. Hmm. By the way, this fanfic is <laughs> to Kai's channel. This is going to be an hour-long fanfic, Louis, because of you. Yeah. And Louis, this is. Read it like a... <laughs> We'll, we'll just turn it into like a five-parter. Can we continue? All right. Really? Okay. He answered, shocked about Amy's generosity. But he must deny her offer since what he wanted is something inappropriate for her. Amy, <laughs> I'm serious about the fact that you're too young to learn such a thing. And if I ended up <laughs> manipulating you into it. It might get yourself killed. Myself, myself. I get, I get myself killed when others uh. find out. He pled. Ah! I'm tired of hearing everyone tell me I'm too young for this. God, she's sound like Apple Bloom. I know. <laughs> yeah, pretty much that, pretty I am a big pony. I'm not young. <laughs> and too young for that. I have grown quite a lot now, especially after all those great adventures yep. with, with I, I've had with Sarah at night. The cutie mark crusaders! Scootaloo, Scootaloo, Scootaloo <laughs> and uh, Sweetie. Oh, Which one would be Scootaloo? Me. I, I would say, I would say, no. I would say, I would say night. Night, night will yeah. night. Yeah. That's Louis, I don't have a poster of you riding your scooter with your butt facing the camera on my wall. <laughs> Please tell me what it is, my dear catapus. I don't know why I like to write that all the time. As I wanted, as I don't want to see you all sad and down. She ranted in reply. <laughs> oh well, it's just that I only wanted to fuck her. <laughs> Wow, Dude. so blunt about it. I, I only <laughs> wanted to. <laughs> He's just this drooling. That's the art's original concept for the catapult, where where it says where it says that uh, he's uh, oh, super quiet, very quiet, and then all he and all he wants to do is uh, is to rape Sierra with his tentacles, and he would sleep in her panty drawer. <laughs> Well, that was her original concept. I think she changed it up a lot by now. Hmm. So, well. Oh, shit, it froze. <laughs> the catapult the the answered... Your computer sucks that much. Yeah, it, it, it I was missing, uh, you guys weren't continuing the story, so I went to something else. The catapult answered nervously, afraid that it may end up... Man wait, hold on, wait. Am, am I on the right... Oh yeah, man manipulating her into doing such a thing. Especially when she tends to get curious over new things. F fuck? <laughs> what <laughs> does Us. it mean? Actually, Emmy answered exactly. curiously. Oh god. You're too young, Emmy! I may be perverted, but all and all, but I don't think you're mature enough to know more about it. Also, I'm not sick enough to fondle with an innocent little girl like you. So, I am, so bring it over here. <laughs> so, <laughs> please, just leave me alone! He scolded and replied. I tried response. to, like, make Ami seem innocent in this one. Uh, accurate to her character design last time I checked. Okay. So This you... cat doesn't know true perversion until it's seen my derpy bro favorites. <laughs> so, you don't want me to help you then? Fine! Emmy muttered angrily as she makes her way back to the road. Upset about the fact that her, that his favorite... Her! It was supposed to be her! I typoed! Ah! <laughs> I was gonna make this perfect, but apparently it 
extent I missed a few yeah, things. I, yeah, I was about to say her. About, about to say her like, you, you, you're, you're having us oh. read it. It's already not perfect. His favorite. Yeah. Yeah, actually, we sure screwed up on the first part, part so. <laughs> <laughs> Just by commenting on Kai's video, can you read my fanfic? I'm like, are you Yeah, done? you we're, done messed up. We're gonna butcher it. <laughs> His favorite pet rejected her offer. As she makes her way out of the woods, he soon realizes he screwed up. <laughs> he really soon realizes that she is the only human. Wait, oh. That he may fuck with now that Siri and Knight have I might, I might just leave soon. I might, I might just leave soon. But he still finds it wrong to fondle with a little girl. Mm. With a little, a little girl like her. Maybe I don't want this on my track record. <laughs> I don't want this on my track record either. I, 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 I don't I'm, care. I mean, she could wait for her to grow up. But that takes way too much time. Oh, freaking lazy. For him. Thinking some <sighs> more. Where's my shotgun? <laughs> he knows that Amy has been very kind and loyal to him for a very long time. And and they've been great friends ever since. Because of this, Amy will most likely accept such an act with him. And he can tell her to keep such a thing as a secret, which reduces the risk of being discovered. Besides, it is impossible for a creature like him to impregnate a human, so the risk of pregnancy is pretty much non-existent. Well, if she's oh, the technical like term for catapus. <laughs> what? Okay, who's who's next? What? What? Uh... I have no uh, idea where we even Spyro are. Spyro's back. Oh, Alright, I'll continue reading then. No, 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 no. Spyro hasn't we? read yet. It may be, right there. Uh, it may. Okay. <coughs> Fuck. It may be wrong for him it... to fiddle with a little girl like Amy. But if she accepts this and will most likely enjoy it. It seems okay for the most part, as long as he educates her more about this later. Wait, the catapus shouted as he swiftly jumps off the tree stump, trying to keep up with Amy. As he charged towards her, Amy turns around, only to find the catapus making a beeline leap towards her with enough momentum to knock her down. Fortunately, they both land on a soft patch of tall grass. I hate this side scroll. It makes me seem like I don't know how to read. Wait, um... <laughs> As a forward uh, to you viewers, please don't judge me up uh, based on this fanfic that I wrote. At least hey, I'm talented, it? and I do more good than bad. At least I'm not one of those hey, sick freaks like Chris. Let me just pull up those like problems and then we'll read that. Uh, yeah, don't judge anyone. We read fanfics. We don't. I'm not judging. I'm judge not judging anyone. I'm just. Problems. They won't judge us. Yeah, we read the fanfic. We don't have any problem. Don't judge him. He just read. He's right. Well, I'm just afraid. Yeah, that, he just wrote the I'm just afraid that. Totally I'm just afraid that people will start uh, hopping into my videos and send me. You should die. You're sick and other things like that. Uh, I'm it comes with being brony. Oh well. It comes with being a, any kind of fan base. Yeah. Look at the anime fan base. I made. Jesus I made. Uh, <laughs> I know. <laughs> Oh well, let's continue. All right, all right. Take, take a take a look at the fucking all the, the fandoms. Pretty much hey, every what? fandom has a weirdo at least. Yeah, but I think the same fan lot of, base has really the, dug itself a hole, big time. But anyways, continue Spyro Dash. Hey, what is it, Catapus? I thought you rejected my offer to help you. She said, "I'm sorry, it was wrong of me to." Reject such an offer from you. I quickly realized that you're the only human girl that I wanted to do and that you can actually care about me so much. You never kicked me or do anything to me and unlike Tira, you've always been there for me whenever I feel down. The catapus confessed. Oh, that's so sweet, my dear catapus, Ari answered. I know that you'd change your mind oh quick, she added. Amy then just pats him on the head which he rubbed his face against in response so what is this fuck oh wait what when? we got derailed we always get derailed <laughs> i'm gonna have to add that part out 
Oh, well. That was fucking long. Uh, okay, so... Uh... So, what is this fuck thing you said, Amy says? Well, it's kind of hard to explain. But it's some sort of act that most girls usually don't like. But honestly, I think it is not that bad. Provided that they have some sort of protection, of course, the cat of us answered. There are so, girls who don't want to fuck? I don't yes, know. Yes, guys. Those are called asexuals. <laughs> No. Well, this Kai, is just... that actually so me. you mean when they're screaming no and get off me that means I'm supposed to stop and get off them yes and that, not that, continue that, that to pour exists. bleach into their brains take this bleach with you oh well let's continue tell me Kai does this does this rag smell like chloroform but anyways let's continue because all I can think about is a, is a cat with tentacles and it's just like, it's burning to my mind of all these things. It's gonna be burning into something else in a few minutes. I can see a crossover between Catapus and just My Little Pony characters and just... I w I'm going to make that happen. I'm gonna write fanfic of Catapus with My Little Pony characters. Yeah, Kai's first fanfic. <laughs> Forget the red credit Miss Butler art for creating such an ingenious character. <laughs> you know what, since we're reading such a wonderful book, I'm gonna start the artwork for the thumbnail. I'm good. doing it. Then we'll have two pictures. Awesome. Two pictures with the price of one. Yes. One is... Oh, shall Thanks. we continue? Right. Kai, you remember, remember my you remember my pictures. Yeah, they were beautiful. Yes. Like they Trixie's know fun house. <laughs> okay, continue, Spyro. I need to get your references, uh, Lou. I don't need... Okay. So, um, after can this. you... Oh, okay. So, um, can you explain more about it, Amy added? But are you sure you wanted to get fucked by me just to make me happy? Like I said, you seem too young for this, and I don't know if you can handle it. He said, let's go. Damn it. I have let's go my back. 18 tentacles. Can you handle me? <laughs> <laughs> this, is not ex this does not contain extreme tentacle hentai, though. <laughs> Damn it. Well, Amby. <laughs> this is my first experiment of making my own clock mix. Well, you're definitely a generous one, Amy, the catapus answered. Wait, what? Oh, wait, I skipped something. <laughs> Amy breaks the silence after thinking for a while. No, okay. no, no, it's, I don't care. I will do anything for you right after what? that. So what is this? I don't after? even know where we fucking are. You just finished I... reading the last sentence and you, didn't, you just lost it? I have to scroll back. Okay, it's, it's I don't care. That, that, that's where you okay. left off. I don't care. I'm gonna put my finger on the screen, right where the next line would be. I don't care, I will do anything for you just to make you happy no matter what. I don't want to see my favorite pet all sad and down, it's just that you're too cute to be in such despair. Heck, I've dealt with many challenges in Sarah and Knight just in the past, I'm pretty sure I've matured enough to handle this. I even almost died from my injuries at one point, Amy answered in response. Well, oh, this, you're is so this is non canonical to, to Miss Butler Art's original vision. This is um, just some stuff I made up to add context or something. Oh well, continue. Oh, you're so kind and sweet, Amy. You're truly an amazing friend to be had, the cat replied. Filled with happiness from Amy's heartfelt response, he hugs her tightly with his tendrils. Amy reacted by hugging back and patting him on the head, which made the cat purr in response. Uh, so could you tell me more about it? Amy asked. Well, you basically take away some or all of your clothes. Damn it. You basically take away some or all of your clothing. Lay down. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing over that spiral? <laughs> Nothing. Or sit in a crawling position and I'll take care of the rest. He answered. After hearing his answer, Amy blushes and left and left silent, since she isn't used to being naked while someone watches her except Sarah. She mentally debates whether or not she'll do this for him. Doing so is wrong, like what Sarah taught her. If not, it'll break her promise with the catapult and surely end badly afterwards. Sarah and this chick remind me of Malone and El and Elena. Well, totally. From what show? Uh, Queen's Blade. Well, totally, Louis, are you still... Are you going to... 
happened? Why is it pregnant? <laughs> no, what? What? You're welcome. The picture that you sent me of Kettleclus. Oh my god. What? Why is it pregnant? <laughs> it's just fat. Oh Why is it fat? Where is it? Because. Penis? Where is it? Can you the link to the picture? The, the so little can't... nubs. Can you see the little nubs? It's on the. It's, it's in the. Uh, co it's in the uh, comments of the of this group chat. It's in the group chat. What your the stash link or that picture that Louis sent? Yeah. Picture that Louis drew. I can't see it. That's my. That that is my interpretation oh, of Cataclysm. Can't Catapus. see it. What He's not in my context. Uh, what version of? Oh. Oh. Okay. Well, let, me, well, let me just um. <laughs> Pack it into a that zip is file. My, that, that, that is my interpretation of catapus. Oh Pack it into a zip file and send it to me, Kai. Oh my god. Why, Lou? Do you love it? <laughs> hey, I like I said, I'm I'm making art for this, so I have to make it terrible. <laughs> so I think mine will be the most accurate. Well, Lou, oh well. You you got competition. Are you gonna send it to me, Kai, uh, Kai as a zip file? I, um, wait, did you say competition? I don't have competition. No matter what I draw, it's better than yours. <laughs> I wonder if I can... Oh, shall we continue? Y yeah, continue. No. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay. Um... Well, Amy breaks after... The silence after thinking for a while. Okay, she finally answers awkwardly while blushing. The catapus smirks in success as he finally managed to hit on a girl after all these years but he must be gentle to her not because she is too young for this but because she is his one and only best friend going all out tentacle rape on her is a terrible <laughs> terrible idea and will certainly traumatize her which he didn't want and said he wanted to introduce it to her nicely and fuck opened up Scott what? Mm. Oh. Nicely in... What? <laughs> and hopes that she will like it afterwards. It's your picture! <laughs> it sucks. <laughs> <laughs> really? Oh, you're definitely a generous one, Amy. The catapus answered, considering your age, I will definitely go gentle with you. <laughs> Especially when this... When this is your first time, he added while well, blushing harder in excitement that he finally has the opportunity to fuck after all these years of trying to hit on Sira, as he paid more attention to what Amy was wearing. She wore beautiful autumn thread Theme. or themed bridesmaid dress with a large bright orange bow on the back, long sleeves beautifully braided hair, a nice gem encrusted tiara, and a skirt that reaches all the way to the ground with beautiful patterns on the bottom. The only downside about her features is that she is flat chested, but she still looks absolutely adorable and is what he has had for me now. He, can, he certainly cannot wait to fuck such a cute and beautiful girl, but he must go slow to not hurt her. Give me a sec, Amy. Gotta make sure no one is watching us, he said as he swiftly climbed up to a tree branch and took a look around the surrounding some more sweep, sweeping around to make sure that there is no one else nearby. Good, it's clear, he said to Amy as he makes his way back down. And so the hentai part begins. Go ahead, Louie. <laughs> Louis. Oh, 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 me, oh, me. Okay, okay, me. okay, okay, sure. How about Why me? The fuck you. Where are we? So, uh -oh. where do we start? <laughs> Wait. Oh, okay, there it is. <clears throat> so, where do we start? Shouldn't that be when? <laughs> Wait, what? Wait, when? Okay, whatever. So, where do we start, Amy Ath? Since this is your first time, uh, Amy, I'm going to start with something that isn't too harsh for you, but isn't... Ah, shit. Good job. This part it. actually had so many rewrites. That, <laughs> uh, isn't good enough 
for starters, since I don't want you to experience the extremes yet. Just something to get you ready. The catapus answer. Uh, the cat. Oh. <laughs> I'm slow. <laughs> but the, I, I took too long to read that. I'm gonna copy all this into a word file so I can read it better. So, uh. So, what should I do? She asks, flushing as she is about to experience something very unusual to her. <clears throat> it's simple. Just sit on the tree stump over there, or over here, and I'll tell you more about it along the way. He answered. <laughs> <laughs> I, why, why am I taking too long why to say that? Why was that a long pause? <laughs> <laughs> oh well, come on, go ahead. Oh. No, no. Okay, the reason I'm I doing this is I have to, I have to, uh, I have to read scroll to read it. Okay, I, I don't like this. Okay, okay go I ahead. I have to scroll to read go it. Ahead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Amy followed his instructions, sitting onto the stump that the cat was sitting on a while ago. The cat followed, jumping onto her lap and faces Amy. Oh shit! What the hell happened? Something, something happened. I don't know. <laughs> Yay! Word file, much better. Something wrong. I have to do that after I'm done reading. <laughs> oh well, can I just continue to make things quick? Wait, what, 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 what happened, Louis? What happened? Like to... the, the, the text just jumped out of nowhere, and did, I, know, I lost my place. Did you drop your lotion, Louis? Yes. Okay. Well, I'll where, just try I just see, continue where, with... Where, 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 where I know where we are. Neither I, do I. Where, where did Louis stay? Hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Let, me, let, me, let me find the place. <laughs> the cat followed, here. jumping onto her lap, and, and, and faces follows. Amy in a somewhat <clears throat> seductive smirk. Well, since this is pretty... Wow, that, that delicate. Not saying D that is a word I have not read in ever. You, actually, you, you are you. Delicate procedure. I'm going to have to tie you with my tentacles to prevent you from panicking. I will tie you down. Don't scream. If you find this too much to, <laughs> for you to handle, just tell me by wiggling as much as you can. Okay? <laughs> oh my God! Really? <laughs> What? <laughs> I'm gonna, well, I'm gonna tie you. Gonna be stuffed. I'm gonna tie you down. Don't scream. And if you are freaking out, just wiggle a little. I know I tied you down. Just wiggle, and I will know that you're freaking out. I don't know. What he said. It makes the catapult seem polite. It makes sure to prepare your hands. Okay. Kind of thing going on. <laughs> she entered, staring to blush and sweat from what he's about to do with her as the tentacles gently tighten her up around her. At this point, she wishes a, to abort, but she cannot break her promise with him. Jesus Christ, Louis. I felt, I, while he was reading, I was struggling to read. So was I. <laughs> My turn is just like, okay, go ahead, go, go, go ahead, go ahead. <laughs> okay. Just, Just as, as he finished building. Then <laughs> directs the tentacle to her face, but unlike his other tentacles, this one is fat, twitching, and is secreting some kind of clear liquid at the tip. Some of it running down the tendril. Ami's eyes widen, seeing a somewhat unusually fat tentacle from him pointing straight at her. What? What are you gonna do with that to me? Ami panics a bit. Relax, Ami. This won't hurt a lot. Especially when I'm being gentle to you, he said in a soft, seductive voice as he starts to become horny. Well, go ahead. As long as it doesn't hurt, he answered as she blushes more. Okay, just slowly, gently, he said as he moves his tentacle into her mouth. Ami eats as the tentacle lightly touches her lips and pulls back a bit, leaving a thin, thin strand of his freak cum from her lips. He then gently pries her lips starting with light, gentle thrusts and shortly after, gently slides in mid-deep into her mouth, 
I mean, chokes a little at the deeper thrust at first, but she quickly begins to moan as she starts feeling weird sensations and closes her eyes as she rides along the catapult's rhythm. Her mouth dripping with a mix of her saliva and the cat's free on staining her dress a little. Noticing this, the cat leans Ami forward to prevent her dress from getting dress from getting stained more, so to avoid suspicion on her. The position change caught her by surprise at first, but soon noticed it was much more pleasurable in this position. Next. Hello. Are you saying, are you saying nice to read? All right. Yeah. All right. All right. <clears throat> He then starts to thrust into her mouth at a fast rate while doing it gently so he won't hurt her too much. His face all blushed up since this was his first time experiencing this sort of act. I, I think I'm going to come. He warns as he Sound does. Lord. Damn it. <laughs> he warns as he does his last few thrusts and shoots his load into Amy's throat. Surprised, she opened her eyes wide and immediately started choking from the slick off-white ooze that was that has filled up into uh, filled up her throat. The cat quickly pulled out his tentacles which started squirting its last drops of his load onto her face and then rolled rolls her off and rolls her onto her side and pats her back to help her recover from the choking. Go ahead, Sparrow. Oh shit. Cough what? Cough what is that? Catafuck. Catafuck. <laughs> Catafuck. <laughs> Cough and when and what is this weird salty off white stuff? It just came out of your tentacle, Amy asks, panting for her. She spits. Last drops have come out of her. Man, it feels so good. The catapus lies in bliss from his first ever orgasm. Oh, th oh, this, I mean, white stuff is what you call semen. Or more commonly called cum. He quickly recovers from the bliss to answer her question and shows his spent tentacle to her, which was coated and dripping with his seed. So what is that stuff for? It looks... Uh, thick and silky, unlike P, she asked as uh, she rubbed uh, a drop of cum with her fingers. I need some water. <laughs> Please. <laughs> Getting a feel of its consistency, which was quite odd for her. Well, this is the stuff that will make animals and even humans like you get pregnant when injected in the right place on females like you, he answered. After hearing the answer, Amy quickly makes a somewhat worried look and initially Puts her in great fear for she is about to become pregnant again. Or uh, whoa, 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 what? Again? I messed up, Kai. <laughs> it's all. Oh! Oh, <laughs> uh, don't worry, Emmy. I don't think my seed will make you pregnant. It only works the semen came from the same species as the female. In this case, you're a human while I'm a catapus. We don't match. He continued, which immediately calmed Amy down from her initial worry. Relieved, she hugged the catapus tightly. He didn't mention you can't get pregnant from a blowjob. Oh, I forgot that. Never mind. Let's go ahead. That'll be a funny it's just joke. A little... It's yeah, like, oh, we're fun. not the same species. Also, I combed in your mouth. <laughs> so what's well, I only the next this thing? Topic for fun anyway. Yeah. So what's the next thing that you wanted to do with me, my dear catapus? I hope it won't choke me. <laughs> it won't choke me like last time. That one kind of hurt. She said, Dang, this reminds me of a Sonic fanfic that I read a long time ago. But, anyways, well. Don't tell me it's written by the infamous <clears throat> Chris Chan. No, I, I don't. Oh, I don't know. But it, it was a fanfic that it had. It had Cream and Chaos. Oh, it, God. It, it reminded Wait, me cream? of Cream and Chaos. I'm going to look that up. <laughs> it, was, it was it was on fanfiction dot dot net. Okay. And well, the next one will not be about coming into your throat uh, anymore, but it has something to do with touching your private parts. He answered. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> so scandalous. What? 
You mean the one in between my legs? She said a bit wordly. Since I'm not sure if I should be worried or proud about your reactions. Since he isn't used to showing her private parts to others. Yes, I want to touch them. I t no, t I want to touch that. That is, if it's okay, if you're okay with it. He answered, shocked. <laughs> he, he answered, shocked. Emmy went silent for a while, debating whether or not he should kill him, but I mean, whether or not she should accept it. Why does the killing come from? <laughs> if she, apparently, Guy has a secret snuff fetish. If she <laughs> agrees. I'm gonna choke Siri. you with my tentacle and come in your throat while you're dying! <laughs> Siri will get really mad at her. If she doesn't, it will break her promise with the cat. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it, Louis! What the fuck? <laughs> I that is the most horribly drawn guy I have ever seen. I cannot see, I cannot see it. Just uh, type on my name is that This whole time I've been drawing that. Uh, oh my god. Hold on. Is that a cigarette or cum? <laughs> no, it's not a cigarette. Oh, hold on. I gotta. I gotta. I gotta. I gotta. Uh, Change that to your profile picture. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, yes. You're welcome, Kai. <laughs> <laughs> 15 kilobytes. I totally forgot where I was at. <laughs> um, you were at the part to where he was about to kill her. Oh, no. that's right. If she does it, it will break her promise. Um, okay. Just be very gentle when touching me. She says, blushing hard, since she is about to do something really, really wrong. For the sake of making her favorite pet happy. <laughs> favorite pet. Man, this is a Fluttershy fanfic. I know. Oh my! Oh my! I assume, I assume <laughs> that the Ami would uh, treat uh, the Catapus as her favorite pet. I'm not sure if it's canon. Miss Butler Art didn't uh, state it very clearly in any for anything drawings, t uh, character descriptions, etc. I have no idea, so I just assume that she would treat her as a treat the Catapus as a, her favorite pet. So yeah. Go oh ahead. my! Are you really sure about this, Emmy? <laughs> he says, oh "Who my. is both? Who is both worried and excited?" Oh, I'm Simu. I'll make an simultaneously. Drawing made by Louis. I'm sure about it. Wait, what drawing? The, the drawing you made. I'm gonna do an HD enhanced version of it, with the magic of. Uh, of wait, of Kai or the catapus? Uh, the what? Kai. The catapus would be probably awesome in HD. <laughs> <laughs> I now I okay. <clears throat> wait, wait, where am I? And she said in reply, Well, okay then, now, lay down on this nice patch of grass over here so we can begin. He said as he points one of his tentacles on a spot he wanted her to lay down on. In response, Emmy then heads over to the patch and lays down on it softly, blushing as she is about to show to him her private parts shortly <gasps> her private parts by the way Louis, I'm gonna check out my stash link uh, to that catapus gift it's in the message box the catapus Wait. then follows what? her and stays put right above Amy's head so he could get a rough esti estimation of Amy's I don't know that where it is. Point of view. Point of view. Oh, wait, when you say point of view instead of say, oh, I'm going to draw another please. picture now. I'm not going to restrain you as much as before, but I'm going to restrain you. For this one, since I only need to keep your legs steady, so 
you find uh, if you find this one too much for you to handle just call out my name Amy he instructs in which Amy nods in agreement she that, then that, takes, that's not gonna work out she then takes he then takes two of his tentacles into Amy's skirt and swiftly raises it up to her waist revealing her cute damn it her cute bright red doll shoes and white stockings that ran neatly across her legs in between how long was her skirt i don't know is that, really? is that even considered a skirt that's more of a dress ah mm -hmm. uh, dress then i got it wrong in never mind in between her legs was her perfectly clean set of white pennies <laughs> seeing them made him explode <laughs> <laughs> Oh, okay. I could make <laughs> such a racist <laughs> joke right now, but I'm not. I see this. The, the fanfic's done, Kai. He's dead. <laughs> he exploded. <laughs> <laughs> Seeing this made one of the cat's tentacles hard to the max eager to rip her right. panties off and straight out penetrate her. But no! He must go gently. <laughs> oh. I can't see somebody animating this. I can just see the cat just like sweating, like globs of sweat. Just go. Oh. <laughs> I can't. <laughs> did, 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 you, did you hear that? That's actually an accurate representation of the situation, Kai. Did, did, you, did you hear that? That was. I, I'm, 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 writing a, I'm writing a fanfic. That I, I, what I, I know. What happened? Oh. Oh. What is up with your roommates and dropping <laughs> Every time they're walking here, just, oh my god, drop it, get out. A second time. She should know better. Oh, <laughs> was it Lilyria? No. Was it, your, was, was, it, was it her? No. It was her. No, one it was your girlfriend, wasn't it, Kai? No, one of my roommates was like looking and he's like, uh oh, he has the derby out. <laughs> okay, can you guys go ahead uh -huh. because I'm gonna have a bathroom break. <clears throat> I'll be right back. What? Oh. Bathroom. No, not oh. not clapping. <laughs> I'm gonna just take a leak. So I'll be right back shortly. Rock hard. He never told us what he was gonna leak. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Amy blushed and eep. And eeps from the breeze of her skirt being raised, showing her privates. It's, her panties are still on. I know. In, in full view, the catapus then pulled the lower a portion of her skirt up to prevent it from getting stained later on. Now, why don't you just take it off? Like, now, no. what are you going to? Like, what now? What? Are you going to do to me next? <clears throat> she asked. Well, I'm going to rub your slit first. Oh my god. Okay, I'm back. To make sure. That was fast. To make sure Very. if you can handle the real thing. It's going to get a tad bit wet, though. He said in a spiral. Warp. Mm -hmm her legs and gently spreads it apart to make her crotch much easier to look at for him. Amy continues to blush and eep from the usual position and prepares to be touched. Okay, go ahead. She demands. I'm done. You guys continue. I I I'm done. <laughs> I'll do it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not gonna continue any some sort of. I'm not gonna read anymore. You haven't read hardly anything. Well, anyways. All, well, if all of you can't read it anymore, I'll just do the. I'll just continue it instead. I'll read it. The cat then touches and lightly prods her panties with his tentacles, which made Amy jolt a little and moan from every contact. Do you think you can handle this, Amy? He asks. Um, I think I can. She answered after hearing those words. He starts to rub her panties along her slit line which made her eep and moan more as her very sensitive part is being touched for the first time. She's never went to the bathroom. 
Mm. Wait, what? I don't think you touch it. When you go to the bathroom and you pee, you wipe that off. Okay, you know what you know what <laughs> she means. Don't don't be a smart ass about this one. Never mind. Let's go ahead. Go. We don't want to stall anymore. Okay. Wait, it's been an hour. Please keep stalling. <laughs> uh, um, uh, this feels uh, so ah uh, ticklish. <laughs> she mutters as she starts to find the sensation is very pleasurable. After hearing such a positive response, he then starts to rub her more vigorously in a circular pattern. At this point, her panties were starting to become wet. I, uh, I think I'm about to pee. Ah! She screams at the top of her lungs, which the cat quickly muffles with his tentacle as she experiences her first ever orgasm, wetting her panties so much that her liquid starts to seep through it. She feels like she was in heaven for a split second, only to quickly collapse from such bliss. Louis, go. Oh, you fucking bastard. Thank you. Where are we? I was busy drawing something. If I don't only... Care. <laughs> if only Mr. 64 was here. The... Okay, so where, are we? Where, where are we? <laughs> Emmy? Let Emmy, are you okay? Are you okay, better. Emmy? Oh. <clears throat> Emmy! Emmy, are you okay? He asked. <laughs> Why is he British? <laughs> I don't know. British Worried, I don't trying know. to wake her up lightly, slapping her face. <clears throat> yes, I'm fine, dear Catapus. <laughs> she answered while painting lightly from her first experience of having an orgasm. Wait. <clears throat> Get the fuck out! Wasn't wasn't that wasn't that line already said? No, 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 Louis. I think you're. I don't know where you are, Louis. But we we never read this before. It's for one thing, that fell. <clears throat> for for one thing. Continue, Louis. Okay, okay. Hello, 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 hello. For one thing, that felt really nice. She added. Wow, sounds like you can handle the next and final step. He said, Would you not mind if I take off your panties for this? He <laughs> added. Th this is getting repetitive. <laughs> take off your panties for a bit? Drink your little tea? Mm hmm. <laughs> <laughs> the British. Okay, go fast. ahead. I want to know how good this will feel like. She demands an uh, anticipating. Yeah. Anticipating. I'm and getting my jollies rock. Oh. For what the catapus will do next. It'll do to her next. Oh, I lost my place. That's stupid of me. It's Sorry. in... Ah, oh. oh, the US... Okay, I mean, wow. wow. You're such a naughty girl, Amy. I never knew that... I'm switching accents. God damn it. I never knew that you could go all out dirty rather quick. Don't worry, I'll do it now, he answered. Special guest author. Read. Ah, okay. What the fuck that was that? that? that was... I'm not sure if I could read it because my parents would go all out suspicious on me. So, uh, I'll just uh, try and I might stop at one point. The cat then proceeds to use one of his tentacles to gen gently tug her silken wet panties away, which made Ami eep since she isn't used to get undressed this way. Revealing a rather small slit, which the catapult stares at for a moment. Hmm, it looks small, but I think it's cute. Just like you, Ami, commented, which Ami accepts, uh, accepts as a compliment. Now, relax, as this is going to feel really good, he said as he gently brings his fat tentacle with some free cum dripping from the tip again, making its way to her crotch area. <laughs> he starts by gently rubbing the tip, which made Ami jolt. Uh, I think I missed a few words here. Oh, uh, I forgot to put them in. Oh, well, uh, which, Ami made, which made Ami jolt a bit harder as he... As he ah, not again! It's she, as she is, be is directly being, you know, I mean, ah, <laughs> as she is directly touching her now and moaning louder as the tip flicks up and down across her slit. She then starts gently prodding the tip into her slit, which made her jolt and moan harder as the tip, tip spreads her slit apart ever so lightly. 
You think you're ready to get penetrated on me? He asks. Pant, pant. I think I can handle. I think I can handle it. Go for it, Ami answered while panting hard from the prodding. Well, someone both... draw the ki- Someone draw like Amy, like the chicken I'm in that thing pony. we watched. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and I have then limits. draw the catapus is like the guy. Mm-hmm. I ha- I have limits. <laughs> <laughs> oh well. Well, shall I continue? Yes, yes, yes. Well, here goes nothing, he said as he rams his fat tentacle just hard enough to gently make its way into her nether regions. <laughs> Ami eats loudly in pain and pleasure as the tentacle slowly makes in its way into her with the occasional hard pump. Can someone say this line for me, please, I, because I don't want to say I it. I will never understand how you can thrust extremely hard, but still but be gentle. <laughs> Unless it's like a cavernous <laughs> vagina. <laughs> That's what I'm thrust in there. I'm gonna do it gently. Like, I don't know. Oh it's a, it's like, I'm it. gonna brutally ass rape you. Gently though. <laughs> I don't know. This is actually one of my oh God. Someone that wants to make a soundboard would have a field day from this. <laughs> oh well. So, can someone read that line for me? Sorry, one after. We'll do it. Come what? on. Start with it. This part here that's after uh, the occasion part. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Perfect. She screams as, she, as the tentacle finally flops inside her. I can't believe it actually fits. She said, panting hard as her slip had been spread wide to accommodate her friend's tentacle. Oh my gosh, you're so tight, I mean, he commented as he started to slowly pump his tentacle in and out of her. As he starts to pump his tentacle in and out of her faster and faster, Ami eats loudly on every stroke, her body pretty much rocking along the rhythm of the cat's tentacle. <clears throat> Wait, I need to open the gate. I'll be right back. I probably should have. Whatever happened to the drill tentacle? I should have I should, I should, I brought Sheldock in here. No, I, I, as much as I like him, I do not like reading fix with him. Why? Why? He, I don't know who Sheldock is. Why? He, he's really OCD about everything being... Perfect. The only thing that's bugging me about this is that on every like line of actual dialogue, you're supposed to break it and put it on a new line. And okay. uh, lame dude doesn't do that. Okay, I'm back. I don't. Whatever happened to the tentacle drills? There's no tentacle drill here. <laughs> he don't know what a tent drill is. I thought it's another term for tentacles. Yeah, but Louis doesn't know that. Because it, it, you know the, oh, the well. you know the, the American um, education system is very very screwed up over there. Oh <laughs> uh, yes, because I learn I, I I yeah because I totally I think teach you learned it from Apple Quest in class. Well, if you learn anything about animals and fish, Louis, I'm sure you will learn what a, that is. Yeah, if I don't think oh, I don't school, take Louis. oceanography. I I didn't take oceanography. There's, Okay. Oh, so they teach you. They teach that shit to you in in a uh, zoology, Louis. Or elementary school. That's the yeah, first thing you, you learn. Cause you learn yeah. about continents and whatnot. But fine, Louis. She screams at a tentacle. I don't think one of the t- continents had anything to do with tentacles. Well, you talk about continents, and you talk about the fish and the animals that live in those continents, and etc. Yeah. Wait, wait, what are you talking about? Do you know what a continent is? Yeah. Yes. And the animals that live fish? on those continents. You know, they have rivers, lakes, Louis. Continents have those. You do know Come on, can we go ahead. in can the we ocean, can right? Almost done. Yeah, I, yeah, I, 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 I guess so, Louis. I guess fishes can't live and can't swim in streams. They can't, they can't swim in the river. Fishes and don't have tentacles. Done. We're, we're almost done. They have squids. Yeah, we're I will the look end. this shit up. I I I I don't want to break Louis' brain, so I'm gonna just leave it alone. <clears throat> Say it. No. She screams as the tentacles finally plop. Okay, go ahead, Sparrow. Damn it! As soon as I, I was think I already read up. that part. <laughs> like, I can't believe it. What? I like, actually uh... fits. She said, panting hard as her slit had been spread wide in to accommodate yeah yeah 
uh, accommodate her friend's tentacles. You guys not use word wrap? Oh my gosh! You're so tight at me! Oh! <laughs> she com he commented as he starts to slowly pump furiously. No. Uh. His tentacle in <laughs> and out of her. As he starts to pump his tentacle in and out of her, her faster and faster, Emmy eeps loudly with every stroke. I don't know how anyone's not hearing this. It's hard to describe sounds for me. If you scream, does the forest make a sound? I don't know. But anyways, um, her- Cuttlefish, sea anemones, and jellyfish all have tentacles, Louie, and they're all considered fish. Well, there you go, Louie. Shall we continue? Her. I don't consider jellyfish a fish. Well, fuck you, Louie. And it's called a jellyfish. Shall we continue? I her body pretty much rocking along the rhythm of the cat's tentacle. I, uh, I think uh, I got a cat really hard at me. <laughs> he warns as he speeds up his pumping. As fast as he could until it jolts and finally unleashes a massive stream of cum into Emmy's womb, filling her up, really up to the brim so much so that it bloated her belly by a few inches until it could no longer reach any further and, and stretch any further, and the rest. Sprayed all along her slit, Emmy was pretty much in a pure bliss as a stream of hot gooey cum is ejaculated, uh, injected into her. He then gently pulled out of her as he tumbles down from his bliss and lies next to Emmy's head. Wow! That was the best <laughs> orgasm I ever had! Oh my god! How about <laughs> you, Emmy? The cat said he was. I mean, the cat asked as he was panting lightly after pumping his boatload of cum into her. It. It felt really good! My dear catapus? She answered while panting heavily after experience for the thing. Uh, thanks for making me feel so much better! Oh, no, no, no. I'm Jade! <laughs> Why is Jade in this fanfic, Todd? <laughs> Why is Jade in this fanfic? You really are my great friend! He said, no. No problem. Besides, you're my Dear Catapus. <laughs> I just realized I was stupid. <laughs> After all, he answered as the two shortly dozed off to sleep. It'd be so fun, like when they fall asleep, people come in and just see them asleep, just naked. I mean, it's just upskirted. Oh well. End, End of hen high part. Phew, yes, phew. That's that's Louis right there. <laughs> Minus a smile. <laughs> well, go go, okay. well, go ahead, Louis. Now that the hentai is over, I'm sure you can be able to handle it. Oh, I have to go back to the story. Where are we? Oh, we're almost done, Louis. Go ahead, take a shot. Where is it? Somewhere high above the sky. Somewhere over the rainbow. <laughs> God, this is a one hour and 16 minutes. <laughs> Turn it into like a 16 part. No, it's gonna be a whole one hour fanfic read. <laughs> no one's gonna watch that. Just this is my apology for making up for all the videos. Here you go, an hour. <laughs> and plus, they've been, and plus, it, 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 it's been like two months. Sky. So. Scarlet had been watching them the whole time, sitting on a cloud along with pet phoenix which rests right on the other side of the cloud ejaculating everywhere streaming the around <laughs> <Hold on. laughs> 
What? Wow! I can't believe Amy ended up getting <laughs> fucked by the catapus! For the sake of making him happy! It must be the power of friendship! She giggled as Shut interesting up, thoughts on what she'll be doing to Amy rushes into her mind. Looks like innocent little Amy here isn't so innocent after all. Oh, oh how funny! <laughs> as she I don't added know. while making a <laughs> sadistic. <laughs> Well, there was well, just, just, he said, oh no, that made me laugh. She added while making a sadistic and mischievous smirk. Fia. Get my dildo. <laughs> <laughs> Please. God damn it, Jay. <laughs> she, sh she shouts, <laughs> awakening uh, her proud phoenix, ready to get mounted. Let's go back back to, to my sky palace, shall we? I need to prepare I knew my it! toys. <laughs> what? She can repair her I toys. I need to prepare my toys for a very interesting plan to do for uh, tonight. Yeah, there's you. Get my dildo. For <laughs> well, I got something for As her. she mounts onto her bird and swiftly flies away towards the sunset. Well, Emmy's gonna die tonight. <laughs> oh, where is that Emmy girl? She promised that she's going to be here shortly, but isn't... But is... Is, uh... Death by snooze Death by snooze <laughs> I can't but believe you actually watched that guy. I, 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 I forgot where that death by snooze snow came from. I think it's Futurama. Futurama. Ah. Oh, I hope it isn't lost in the woods. CM mutters worryingly. Shortly after, the castle door is swung open as Amy makes her way in. A bit weakened after that, after what she had with the catapus, but she tries to to be as normal as possible to her, to avoid suspicion. Suspicion. So yeah, I'm home. Amy announced, hearing her. Oh shit, I did it again. Good job, Louie. Uh, hearing her, Thea rushes towards the main entrance to check on her. Oh my, I was so worried about you, Amy. Tell me, why did you come here so late? I looked back at the so strange. <laughs> what exactly did you do, Amy? <laughs> See it, man. <laughs> oh, where am I? Sarah, uh, demand Sarah demanded as she continues to analyze her. The catapus instructed Amy not to tell anyone about what they did recently, so she had to come up with something very good. With a very good lie to avoid getting caught. Um. I... I helped save a fungo kid who was trapped inside a hole which was deep from for him to climb out. <laughs> Amy replied nervously, hoping that it's good enough to fool her. Louis, that was you talking to her? You would have lost. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to sound convincing as possible. That was totally not convincing. <laughs> That was the point. She doesn't sound convincing. You don't sound convincing at all. Oh, well, continue. <laughs> okay then. Just take a bath right now, as we're about to eat our dinner shortly. I'm gonna stop there. Okay, I'll read the rest. Sira answered as she walks toward the dining room to prepare for dinner. Amy then heads toward the bathroom to have a nice warm bath to relieve herself from today's events. As she scrubs her belly, she notices it got it got slightly bigger after she made out made out with the catapus. Feeling proud of making someone happy, she rubs it gently and smiles. After she finishes eating her dinner, she then heads off to her bedroom and dozes off to sleep. As Amy sleeps soundly, right outside her windowsill, 
The catapult makes his way across the gardens and eventually hops his way into Ami's room. He then finally hops onto Ami's bed and snuffs him snuff himself right next to her. She wakes up after noticing his presence and lightly pats him on the head, making the cat purr in reflection. Will you still want to F with me again, Ami? He asks. Once the swelling of my private regions have died down, we can. She answered lovingly. They both hugged once again before dozing off to sleep, lying on their bed peacefully. The yeah, end. Fucking end. <laughs> Coming soon, maybe. Scarlet Bliss. I'm not sure if I'd ever write that, though. I, <laughs> I have a headache. <laughs> oh, well. Miss Butler. I have a really, really. I think my penis might have inverted inside itself. <laughs> <laughs> now, that's what you call what? A man china? <laughs> a man china! <laughs> oh, at least we're done with this now. What do you guys think about my fanfic? Should I feel proud about it or should I be ashamed for making such a thing? Even though I think Miss Butler Art deserves to add A little bit of column A, um, a little bit of column B. Okay. Let's the dialogue do, 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 was just weird. Do you want my full opinion? What is it? Change up the dialogue. <laughs> yeah. Oh. This is well, the one time I'll agree may, Maybe movie. don't be too descriptive on... What was it? Uh, don't say their exact thoughts. And then have them say what they're thinking right after it. Yes, that. Well, they, 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 they don't themselves a little bit too much. Yeah. And, and also, well, this... the, uh, like, I, I, I know you're supposed to say this after you, you, you they say something. You know, the he said and he asked, but I think there's too much of that. That was my limitation when it comes to <laughs> making the stop. You said and the, some that that's what the, that, that, that's what they call a one-shot fanfic. And then some that bugged me was, uh, whenever there's dialogue, you're supposed to insert a page or a line break, put it on a new line, and you didn't do that. I see a lot of people don't do that, the line break thing. Like, I know, it bugs yeah, me. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Everybody had their own little style of doing it, and it was like, it's alright. Well, that was tiring, but at least it was fun. I'm not sure about the view. Uh, uh, view yes, uh, fun. That's the word I would choose to describe this. Thanks for watching! <laughs>